Welcome to week nine of the fifth season of the Southern Nation League. I'm your play-by-play -play analyst, Joshua Gonzalez, and I'm joined here with Ziggy Zay for the first game of today, which is the Reapers, brought to you by Campus Customs versus the Goblins, brought to you by Zane the Realtor. I think I would want to go with the Reapers. Oh, okay. The Reapers. Just to make it interesting. You know what? I'm, I, I might agree with you. To be honest, I'm pretty sure it was like 12 minutes into the game before he, before Juan even shot the ball. Exactly. You know, it's basically he was going into the half and he shot the ball for the first time. It's insane. Yeah. If they put the As ball, Juan goes up yeah. and finishes. Uh, wow. Sweet finish of the day. Brought to you by Ash's Bake Shop. We're starting here early. I, I believe if they put the ball in his hand a lot, they'll win it. Oh yeah. Not saying that he needs it because mm -hmm. you got. He plays on the other team. I mean, on a team too. So yeah, he didn't seem in his element either in the second half as well. But I feel like the way they they need to utilize him is to get him warm early, get him yeah. hot early, and then everybody can follow suit. Because you got you got Dre, who's always dangerous from the three point mm -hmm. line. You have Tyreek. You still have you still have Chief. Exactly. So you know, Zane. I feel like they just gotta get him start early. Zay not playing today. Good layup for Sway. Yeah, Zane isn't playing today. That's interesting. They don't have Big Bird. Oh, they don't have Big Bird. Nah, they, right. they got one player on each, on both bench. <laughs> they yeah. only got one energy guy on the bench. Ooh. Tries to get a put back there. Dean can't hit, and now it's the Reaper's ball. Mo bringing it up. Fonzo bringing it down. Oh, my bad, Fonzo. <laughs> <laughs> Mo on the bench. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Yeah, he's just chilling there. Nick, Nick doing what he do, uh, always looking for the ref to bell out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look out. Oh, yeah, yeah. It was a good take. I just feel like he could have passed out. Yeah. Sometimes, sometimes Nick moved without the ball. Woo! That was a nice move, but he couldn't connect. Fonzo, good Fonzo. pass to Phil. Oh, that's Phil, Phil. all day. Yeah. Easy. That's easy. Phil is not one of them showboating plays. He's just smooth and just get what he wants all the time. Yeah, he's very straightforward with the way he plays basketball. Here Dean comes Dean. For three. Oh, oh that's air ball. That's brick of the day. Brought brick. to you by Zane, the realtor. <laughs> <laughs> Usually I'll give it to him, you know, the first shot of the game. I won't say book of the day, but yeah. I think that was like what Yeah, that was, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was yeah. Good. That's early in, too. Yeah, that's early. Ooh. Okay. Uh, Reapers Alfonso. are playing aggressive. Battle of the brothers, Tyreek and Alfonso. Oh, oh yeah, wow. you're right. I forgot. The battle of the brothers. Wow. I did not know that either. Yeah, right? <laughs> let's, let's see. That's interesting. Let's oh. see who take it. Yeah, we'll see who wants more in this game. Right. Chris coming in with the defense. The Reapers come up with it. Here comes Phil. Passes it to Sway. Sway goes Sway. all the way. What's that, the sweet finish of the day? Brought to you by Ashes Bay Shop. You're right. <laughs> Let's go. It's going to be a competitive one. Chief yes, wide open. Takes it. Ooh, that was Ooh. a high arcing shot. Yeah. I think that's like Fonzo fourth rebound. Already. Yeah. That's impressive. Oh, oh. No. Ah, he bobbled. It looked like he was yeah, bobbling the ball. Yeah, they call Fonzo. it. Yep. Uh, I'll say a foul, but. I heard a slap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, hey. Here comes Juan. Yeah, if he could prove himself early, I feel like yeah. the Goblins would be straight. Yeah, that's exactly what they need to exactly. do right there. And, and there's nobody to match up on the, on the, on the Reapers right now. Really, not really, because they're no. really all small yeah. other than Phil. Phil's like the only tallest one. Like, I think he is the tallest one yeah. on the team. Oh, here comes uh -oh. Sauce. Sauce being aggressive. Yep. He pulled a double team on him, finds Nick up top. Let's see what Nick do. Bang! Nick, makes Nick it three. in! That's the assist of the day brought to you by We Buy Houses. That was a good pass from the baseline. Here comes Juan. Too Oof. easy. Oh, and Sauce comes up with it. The smallest one in the group, man. Right? <laughs> you got to slow it down right there. I feel like he could have yeah. grabbed the rebound, held it a little bit longer. Uh, Looked like Juan's hurt. He's hopping. Oh, yeah? Yeah. What did you see him? What was he grabbing? He's grabbing his leg. Oof. Probably a cramp. <laughs> I don't know how many people went out drinking last night, so might be just a little bit dehydrated. Everybody Irish today. Good screen, good screen. 
Juan taking it in again. Has a smaller defender on him. Decides to rise up, but can't hit. Dre with the rebound. Oh, good pass. Oh. That was a great pass, though. I like the way they're playing right now. Yeah. They're passing the ball a lot. It's all about facilitating, and I feel like that was one thing that I highlighted as well. If this team can facilitate the ball, move it around, get you know the Reapers' heads moving, it'll open up opportunities for them to score. Yeah. Juan makes the first one. Let's see if he's good for the second. And Juan good for the second. Two for two. Nice pass to Chris. Chris to Phil. Phil looking for the lane. Oh, but he couldn't get it. I'm not, I'm not mad about that. I'll let no, him keep yeah. doing that. Let him keep doing his thing. Eventually, he's going to find the lane. Exactly. Here comes Dre. That's too small for him. Yes. Oh, good pass. Oh, what a block by block. Phil. That's the matchup. That's the matchup yeah. right there. Keep Phil on one. Mm -hmm. Good, good, good. Oh, man. The Reaper's Still defense is something Nick. that stands out, man. It really does. Oh, what a pass. That's the assist of the day. Brought to you by We Buy Houses. Wow. <laughs> That was a great bounce pass. It was. Not too many of those. Mm. Good matchup. That's the matchup. Oh, and then bounces off his foot. Yeah, you're right. That is going to be the matchup for this game. It is. So far, it's been exciting. High pace. We got a Batman. Batman in the game now. Chris takes it in. Can't hit. Dre with the rebound, and now Tyreek is going to be taking it up court. Oh, Nick yeah, takes the charge. charge. Oh, yeah, that was, man. <laughs> he was coming in hot. Wow. I think he saw his brother and wanted to run his brother over, too. <laughs> <laughs> I think his brother moved out the way. He knew what he was dealing with. I think I would have done the same thing if I saw my brother. <laughs> No, his offensive foul. Yeah. Here comes Sway. Oh, dude, he's been so dominant with that, yeah. man. Just taking it in and going up and getting a bucket. So you have to you have to try to stop Sway driving. He don't really look to shoot too much. Right. That's easier said than done, too. I know. Because, he's, I mean, he's really shifty, too. Because mm -hmm, you're going to have to get two people to close that lane, and it's going to leave someone wide exactly. open. Exactly. Here comes Nick. The, Reap the, Reapers, the Reapers got good defense today. Oh, they got good passing today, too. Phil for three. Can't hit. Look, they everywhere. Lonzo. Look, they're everywhere. Look at that. And they're just so fast. Exactly. Everyone's eyes is right on the ball. They're not taking their eyes off it. Phil with the good leg. Hey, sweet finish <laughs> of the day. Brought to you by Ash's Big Shot. Timeout wow. for the Green Goblins. All right. The Goblins take a timeout. And while they do that, we'll go to We Buy Houses and Mobile Homes. Any type, any condition. No equity, no problem. We work fast, use cash, and there's no nonsense. Up to $1,000 if you refer a home that goes to closing. To speak to Josiah Kenyon, give him a call at 407-735-6228. Thank you. 
the screen. Good bounce pass. He's got some space off the side of the rim. Here we go. Nick with the glove. That was a big trade for the Reapers, man. A it huge was. trade. We, we, we got no um, Noah today, neither. Yeah, and then, and then the Goblins trade up Brandon Steed, who really had a great yeah, performance last exactly. week as well. They might be missing him low-key. That was a great... That, that was a good 15, maybe almost 20 points off the bench. 
Oh, and now they don't have that. No, so. right, because I think, oh, I, don't know what he scored last game. I think I think he scored like 16 last game or something like that. Those are 16 points they could have used to win that last game. Exactly. But man, the Reapers are looking hot here. But you know what else is hot? One hop to shop, man. One it's the official shop. home of the Cell Nation League merchandise. This week, they had their first drop of their official Season 5 CNL merch with hoodies, t-shirts, and long sleeves. Contact Cell Nation on Instagram to place your order in today. Man. You don't look that old, though. Me? I know. I, I like it like that. Everybody think I'm feeling much funny. That's good. We'll keep it that way. I'm not even going to ask you how old you are. <laughs> Juan takes it up and makes the mid-range shot. That's another thing I feel like uh, uh, Juan could do more is take those mid-range shots. Yeah. He's good there. I don't think there's a lot of people on that team other than Phil that could stop him there anyway. We're seeing pass it to Phil. Phil takes the lane. I got a jump ball. Thank you. All right. Yep. All right. They're going to call it a jump ball. Good defense from the Goblins. At that moment. <laughs> right now, the score is 33 19. The Reapers up. Chris observing the floor. Finds Fonzo, slips out of his hands. Now, Nick has it up top. Oh, man. Looks like they have. Oh, that was a good lane to take. Oh, I could have hit. Here comes Dre. Beans all the way down. They don't seem like they're going to pass it to him. But hey, Dre, Dre gets the foul. Yeah. Sometimes you take it in because you know you can score. Sometimes you take it in because you know you're going to get the contact. And I, th I think he knew he was going to get the contact there. So to play it safe, he went up with it. Because Dean, I mean, Dean was open down there. I don't think he wanted to risk a uh, you know, steal though or a tip or anything yeah. like that. So that was a smart play. Smaller than he is. So. Yeah. So that was, that was a smart play. Yeah. Oh, here comes Tyreek. Oh, I guess the tunnel vision is starting to pay off here. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Sway <laughs> looked kind of frustrated. It looked like he wanted Nick to stay where he was at. Oh, but oh, Juan tips it out. Good defense. See, that's what the, de the, the goblins need to do is to exactly. play defense exactly defense. like that. Like aggressive. Try to take it out of their hands. Right here, look. He gives no space. I lied. He gave him a lot of space. Uh, I'll, I'll gamble it. with that with, with Sway <laughs> shooting. Right, right. He's more deadlier inside. Yeah. Oh, Tyreek on his bro. Okay, he's just oh, brother, Drake yeah. for. Oh, in and out. Oh, does he get a second chance? Makes some jump. Finds Dean at the top. Dean. Oh, oh can't make it. Oh, Juan battles for the rebound, gets it back. Here comes Dre taking it up. Oh, makes it in. That's a sweet finish of the day. Brought to you by Ash's Bake Shop. But I think, yeah, that was a hard collision. Two two players uh, down. That was a pretty hard one. All right. Yeah, that should have been a foul. That's crazy. <laughs> I guess not. And we're going to resume the game. Still a 10 point lead here. Reaper's up. Here comes Sway. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, they're starting to, it's starting to get a little bit gritty here. Yeah. They said forget the three. We're just going to battle it out for the paint. <laughs> All right. There you go, Mo. Mo. Oh, Mo. Good pass. Mo's good at that. Oh. oh. That was that was a bad word. <laughs> that was a bad word. If anything, the pass should have came up right here. But. Chief, ooh, that's quick. He got to shoot that. He got to be aggressive. He does. He had. A, he had, I'm pretty sure he had a decent game last game. Yeah. Oh, puts it up. There, there. I mean, hey, Tyreek is starting to find it now. 
Better be careful. Oh, Sauce brings them all in. Toss it back. Almost a backward violation. Phil takes the shot. Can't hit. Oh, another collision. Mo did a good job of just yeah. letting it, just he, let it happen. He ran the yeah. He didn't. No contact. Chris for three. Yeah, he was like, yeah. <laughs> I'll let you I'll let you follow a little bit, please. Yeah, but knowing the rest we got, they probably would call. <laughs> You're right. But good thing Eric don't call anything. So. One for three, and he makes it. There we go. It's a five-point game. Yeah. Just like that, right? Just like that. A minute 30 left in the game, uh, left in the half. Sauce tries to hit one of his own. Ooh, Juan. Look at that. Dude, that, look how fast that. he is, exactly. man. Tyreek with the save. Can't put it back in, though. Dude, Tyreek is he's yeah. playing really, really great right now. Dean. Oh, good three-point shot. Oh, yeah. Break of the day brought to you by Zane, the realtor. <laughs> oh, but he makes uh, up he for makes it. it. <laughs> oh, hey! Oh, three, you, he puts three, a hand three points air. now. It's they, either on his hips or in the air somewhere. <laughs> they closing it out good for the second half. <laughs> Sway finds Phil up top. Phil with the hesitation. Oh, that was a nice fake. It was so sudden, like yeah. so subtle too. Like he didn't even. <laughs> <laughs> I love Phil, bro. Mm -hmm. The guy's funny. Stop calling it on the floor. <laughs> Stop calling it on the floor. <laughs> yep, there goes Zane. Energizing the team. Do. They missing birdie. Oh the, ha oh, the hands on the knees. Uh. Oh, that's when you know it's serious. Box out. Here comes Juan. Good pass. Chief. Oh, great pass. I'd say let Chief facilitate that. Oh, facilitate, but then again, you gotta be aggressive too. As well. That, yeah, that would right. draw a lot of attention off of him. They right. don't know what he would do pass or finish. Great for Phil. That's the assist of the day brought to you by We Buy Houses. Wow. Just like that by seven. Go back up by seven. And that's exactly what the Reapers needed. Someone who could shoot from that kind of range. Yeah. It's a good defense. Juan is strong, though. Yeah. Good pass. Dre takes a mid-range shot. Can't hit. Zane is right. They got to get back, and they do so. They do. But they cannot leave the people who have been hitting threes open. Finds Phil again. Phil for another three. Oh! Yeah. Buzzer beater! <laughs> Phil is feeling it! <laughs> and they went right back up by 10. Wow, wow. right back up. You're right. Insane first half. And with that, here's a word from our sponsors. This is Zane the Realtor. I'm your go-to guy for all things Central Florida here to make your Florida living dreams into realities. I'm all over the place. I'm going up north towards Ocala. I'm going west towards Lakeland and Tampa Bay. I check out homes out east towards Melbourne, Palm Bay. I'm checking out all the most beautiful homes and the best deals here in the Central Florida area. So if you're looking for a home, you know who to call. Zane the Realtor. I get buckets in the housing market and I get buckets on the basketball court. Please reach out to me. My information all over over the screen here. Check me out on social media at Zane the Realtor. Let's go Goblins. Thank you, Josh. We love you guys. Ladies and gentlemen, week nine of the regular season. Every game matters right now for this conference. And goddamn, the new look Reapers look hot. They are up 10 points right now. They're up 15 most of the half. Goblins make a nice run. They're up 10 again, 40 to 30. They're looking good. They're playing both ends of the floor. Phil's making their lives a, real, a lot easier. That's why Coach Sauce traded for him. He knows he needs to make his guy's life easier. Uh, yeah. Let's let's go see. Let's check in with Mike Mitchell, making his refing debut. I don't know if it's a debut or not. Mike, come here, big guy. Yes, sir. 
Have you ever refed a game before? Yeah. In this league? Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought it was your debut. No, no, not my debut. Not my debut. Well, what, what are your takeaways uh, from the first half? Uh, stop thinking that you get fouled. Stop thinking you're getting fouled. Yeah. Both, both like, teams? Oh, I felt some. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, because he swatted, but he missed you. There you go. All right. You heard it here first. Have a good next half. Yeah. From Mike Mitchell. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> All right, we're coming back. Uh, for some reason, it's 39 to 30 right now. I don't know what happened, but I guess we'll find out in just a second. But much love, Axe. I love you. We're back. Second half action coming back. Back to you, Josh. Yeah, we got to get the score right here just so it's a fair game. <laughs> All right, so they're going to go with 40 pitch. They're all by 10. I'm by 10. Reapers, I mean, like, Reapers. I, 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 I would, I would argue that too. They're putting in work. Yeah. You, know? you don't want to, you don't, exactly. even if it is a point, you know, yeah. because you could lose by exactly. a point in this game. So, I can, I can understand why they want to get that right. Oh, they're not paying attention. It looks like the Goblins took advantage of that. Juan, nice finish. They gotta sometimes, pay attention. Yeah, I say, yeah. sometimes they gotta let the side do what they gotta do. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh, it looked like it was a double dribble. Key, I think, but, I think hey. Chief hit it. it looked, I think Chief oh, hit it. Okay, then it probably bounced out but of his hands. That was a good take, though. But then again, Mike don't use his whistle, so you never know. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> that was a nice hero step either way from Yeah. Story. Oh, Tyreek for three. Dre, Dre the puts it back. Oh, sway, here he comes. The ball. Oh, another hero step. That's his move, man. Sweet finish of the day. Brought you by Ash's Bay Shop, man. He's. I give him eighty-five. I give him eighty-five percent inside. <laughs> if he was a two K player, yeah. yeah, probably ninety. Oh, exactly. Tyreek comes up with it on his brother. Oh my God, that's <laughs> on his brother. That's a nice finish. Yeah, it was a nice finish. Sway. Sway, Sway is in his zone. Oh, he's in his zone. Sway, Sway Sweet in finish his of the day, brought you by Ash's bait shop. Oh, my goodness. Zone. I feel like he feels like the basket is, like, super wide open right now. Batman, Batman confused before the ball even got yeah, to him. He was standing like this, and the ball went. <laughs> no, no energy from Batman. <laughs> That was kind of funny, bro. I, like, I literally thought he was going to cash that, and he, just, he was like he just this before like, the ball even <laughs> bounced off, like, to him. Now it's Reaper's ball. Sway again. <laughs> Good pass. We you see they're, they're starting to... What was that? Oh, Juan. The call foul on Juan. I guess a reach in. A reach in on Juan. <laughs> <laughs> Mike look on Trump, the call. <laughs> the thing is, the, gobl the Goblins, they can play good defense. I think they're just all over the place just because of how much the, the Reapers are passing the ball. I mean, yeah, the, yeah, the Goblins being played better defense. <clears throat> oh, good defense. They got numbers. Here comes Dre. I think they heard me when I said yeah. I play better defense. Here comes Juan on another three. Can't hit. <laughs> They find Nick. That's a Nick all alone. Bounces off the back of the rim. Yeah, I, Nick, Nick always looking for a foul. Nick want a foul. <laughs> the three point line. Uh -oh. That's fun. Oh, Dean. Oh, Fonzo didn't give up on defense. The steal. Stops, pass it to Arasina just so he could get himself more wide open from the three point line. And, and he hits. That's the assist of the day brought to you by We Buy Houses. That was actually very smart. It was. Give it to Arasina. He's going to crash in so that way he doesn't get it. It's a 2v1 at that point. And in C Goblin defense, nobody came back down on that either. Exactly. They, they have to hustle. Exactly. Dean, just like that. Just like that. They got to hustle. Get a stop. Get a stop. Play with urgency. Let's go, Green. Oh, yeah. I think Coach of the Year should go to Zane. Yeah. <laughs> no free, no free. He's yelling, get a stop, but his face turning red, looking like a stop sign. <laughs> Fonzo takes another dunk. Nick with a big rebound. That was a big rebound, Sway. You don't want it in Sway's hands right here. Oh, my. Oh, Batman takes a charge. Black and foul on Batman. So that counts, right? <clears throat> I think the call on the floor. Okay. Oh, they counted it. Oh, you can, okay. They, yeah, they counted it. They counted it as an one? Yeah. Okay. Hey, Green, seats off. Let's go. Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> like, 
Batman was Batman literally closed the lane and he still got there. It's insane. Yeah, no, his, I think his inside should be ninety. <laughs> I might even say ninety five. Ninety five. <laughs> Free throw probably seventy three. Yeah, <laughs> I'm just playing. Three three point out of seventy. <laughs> <laughs> there goes Dean. Doesn't make it. I guess they're not representing for green today because it's definitely green to I mean green day today. Oh yeah. Sway with another Sway with finish. Another finish. At this rate, he might score 30 again. He just might. Mm-hmm. Here comes Juan to Batman. Batman can't hit it. That's a brick of the day brought to by Zane, the realtor. That was, that's an easy Sway deal. again. Oh! <laughs> That would have been that would have been crazy. I'm a big fan of dunks, so I really wanted that to go in. <laughs> <laughs> I you it's a Reaper's game. They got they got Reaper's hey, new and improved. They have to put their heads down and they gotta, you know. They have to. Somebody they gotta find an answer for Sway. Yeah, they gotta play a little bit more aggressive. I will go Juan on Sway. And try to help defense at, in the key. In the key. Who's the big? Oh, uh, it's only one. It's not big. And with that, we're going to go to the sideline report with Parker. Reapers just keep going up. I mean, goblins look like they're crumbling right now. Let's go hear what's happening. We're walking over. We're walking over. Thanks, Josh. We're walking over. They're mad at the possession. Green, if you're the goblins right now, Goblins! I was about a quarter, like one fourth of that uh, breakdown. That's that's how it's going for the goblins today. This is not looking great. <laughs> not that we need back. All right. Speaking about close enough, these goblins got to make this game a little bit closer. Gotta start playing with a little bit more tenacity, a lot more defense, and a lot more of this passing. Look at this. Uh oh, Fonzo with the pesky. Fonzo is Fonzo is just Fonzo really pesky. Oh, his defense is crazy. Phil gets Phil. it in. With another way. Sweet finish of the day brought to you by. Action. Oh my God! Look at them. Uh oh, another steal. Chris for three. Can't hit. Dude, the Reapers. The Reapers wanted more. The Reapers are starting to score now, and they're showing off their defense. You know, exactly. in the beginning of the season, before we even, you know, before the, the, the season even started, uh, I remember the first podcast, we were talking about their defense, how they're very big on that. They have Sway, they have uh, Chris, Sauce, they have Nick, Nick Arcina. Fonzo plays good defense, too. Yeah, Fonzo plays a good defense, too. So now, so now it's starting to, to really show. Yeah, it's starting to match up with the offense. So, yeah. And when that happens, you guys can see what they could do with the numbers. They're already exactly. at 55. And, and on top of that, they're keeping the goblins and they're holding them at 38 points. So that's insane. <laughs> and there goes to show you where, where the teams could go fall at in this league because goblins right. was number one. They fall terribly down. Yeah, they start off, what was it, 4 0? Yeah, 4 0. Wow. They, and honestly, when I looked at that offense, I was like, wow, this is a very dangerous offense. They have a lot of shooters, a lot of scorers, and now it's just the complete opposite. Exactly. It's insane. Nick, Nick gets it player. in! Wow. Yeah, the Reapers are playing at a very high high pace. Can't hit. And this they, is where they this is where they, they had trouble. Dropping. This is where they had trouble. They started shooting themselves into a deficit and it's starting to show up again. They need to slow the ball down. They, got, they still got 13 minutes to turn around. Even they though they're do. down by 17. They're down by 17, but anything can happen in this league. And if you're going to make something happen, it has to be now. Yusuf showed that last week. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. I did not believe it, but... Me neither. Yeah. It all came out to a timeout. Exactly. Can you believe that off the inbound? Whoa, jeez. And instead, they came up with a defensive play, Mako's ball, and I think on 2.8 seconds, freaking Yusuf hits the game-winning three. It was an insane Mike, game. Mike said he had four seconds to shoot, but it wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> that was insane. Phil for another three. Can't hit there. And now the Goblins have numbers coming down. Here comes Dean. You see when he turns on the Jets? Exactly. It's different. You got to add a little bit more energy. Look at Sway again, doing what he does. Oh, oh my God. and gets it in! I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna put add another five with 100 percent from layup. <laughs> Sweet finish of the day, brought to you by Ash's Bake Shop, man. What's up, baby? What's up? How are you doing? 
I'm good. Not your team. Not gonna be here. I just talked to Brandon last night. They're not big again. And dude, Sway is having a hell of a game. As a matter of fact, Sean, how, how much does uh, Sway have? You know, you haven't taken a loss in a minute. Let's see how they play together. I think they should be all right, though. 21? Wow, he has 21, yeah, 21 points. points. And he still has 11 minutes to go in the game. 22? Yeah, he just made that free throw. Oh, yeah, 22. 40, wow. 60, 40. I thought he would have had about 40 by now. <laughs> yeah, I know. But he the, might. He still has time. Yeah, but the twos move slow. You're right. Oh, good. Oh, look at the, the passing, passing from this team. Oh. Gets the bucket. That's the assist of the day. Brought to you by We Buy Houses. Might be the assist of the year. That was insane. Reaper's out there having fun right now. They are. You can tell. Look at him. Look at Nick. He's just laughing. You don't see that like that too much often. He's basically saying, Goblins, where you at? Step back three. Juan can't it's hit. Nothing is falling for the Goblins. And, this, and that's, that's exactly what happened last game. They started to shoot themselves into a slump while they're letting the other team shoot. Yeah. You know. The crazy thing is they gain good luck, but it's just yeah. nothing dropping. They're not forcing anything. And I honestly, I thought this game was going to be more of a shootout. Wow, they didn't call that one. <laughs> Sway is shocked. Sway is staring at the camera in disbelief. In disbelief. <laughs> But hey, they didn't call it. They didn't call it. Get back to the game, even even though you're up by a lot. Exactly. <laughs> 63, 44. Good, good job. Just don't give them anything. Phil and Tyreek. Phil getting to the spot. Yep. Good defense by the Goblins there. Here comes Chief. Chief finds Dre. Dre takes a three point shot and hits it. I think it needs to come to Dre. Yeah. He needs to, he needs to get touch the ball a little bit more at the three point line. I saw him during warm ups. That man was hit. He hit like six threes in a row. They gotta start giving it to him. Yeah. I feel like start finding him open and you know let let Juan recharge a little bit. Oh, doesn't make it. Two misses. That's break of the day. Brought to you by Zane the Realtor. Two open shots to the basket. Look, look, Here look, comes Chris. Reefers, Reefers with another steal. Another steal. And more passing. Oh, up and under. Can't hit. Uh oh. Here comes Juan. They got numbers. Good Dre. Oh. Good block. Dude, the Reapers the are Reapers. looking they really scary. Want it. They really the Reapers want it. are looking scary. Wow, man. Oh, man. The Goblins read what they saw. Hmm. That's a good one. <laughs> That's a good one. Quote that. Oh, man. Yep. Here comes the Reapers. Oh, man. This is his first miss. miss. I think that's his first miss to, of today. <laughs> <laughs> Might that, be that. With the way he's playing today. Oh, good. Good layer by Dean. I'm out, Reaper. I'm out, Reaper. And with that, we're going to go to the sideline with Parker. You know you are, you are in control of this game. When your first time out comes with less than nine minutes left in the game, the Goblins have used almost all. They only have one time out left. They go on a little run. I mean, the Reapers just look like they want it more right now. Goblins are basically fighting with each other at this point. They're discombobulated. Thank you. Sway. I said it on the pod. You're my MVP front runner, and every week you just keep proving me right. Thanks. I love him. I love that guy so much. <laughs> we're back. <laughs> and we're back. Thank you, Parker, for that sideline report. 65-49, 16-point game. Zane, Zane the realtor, right? He was telling his team, you guys have to dig deep. 100% correct. you got to dig deep. <laughs> Oh, but you can't Nick, let them no, no, score. No, 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 no. Nick, Nick, Nick looking for a foul. No, it wasn't yeah, a Nick. foul. It wasn't a little... <clears throat> Dre, Dre for three. For three. Love, gets it again. It has to go to his hands. Dangerous Dre is what we call him. Here. At least that's what I call, call him. Call him Dee Dee. Dee Dee. I'm pretty sure he doesn't want me to call him that. <laughs> Nick with a good cut. They just they Dean, can't stop it. They got to stop it. They got to stop the it. It's defense. They, they can't go back to back. No, they cannot. You're right. Look at Dre. Find Dre. Dre. Oh, and he just muscles his way in. Got it. Got it. He's Wheaties. 
<laughs> wow. I think it should switch. I, I think Juan should go up into the paint and start dominating yeah. there and let Dre cook up top. Oh man, good passing by the Reapers. Nick with a three. Can't hit. Oh my god. The, the, ball, the ball touches pause. The ball <laughs> the ball touches at least three Reapers' hands before the shot goes up. And that's where they're and that's exactly why they're up. Exactly. The fa the facilitating of the ball is something that few people understand. Another three point shot. Oh, he misses that one. I don't care. I'm still passing to him. Exactly. Loser. Keep shooting, Dre. Play defense. And you know, passing, La Familia is really good at that as well. Yeah. You know, and I feel like that's that's where they shine the most is the fact that they they give touches to everybody before a play's even made. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Mid range shot. Wait, he's going off, man. I think I think everybody on La Familia takes the uh, an energy drink before they play. <laughs> La Familia just come out with so much energy. No, Santi last game was. Insane. Oh my God. We tried our best with Santi. <laughs> I know. I'm not. Talking and it just wasn't. <laughs> It, it was his day for sure. For sure. Man. Seven for nine so for the three point line is crazy. He's he's so good. And another and another smooth player. Not too shifty, but just get what he want all the time. Three point play, Phil. Yeah, it's gonna be hard. It looks like the Reapers are looking to bury the goblins here today. Yeah. Dre, Dre deep, deep. Dre. and makes it again. Dre's the only one fighting for his life out there. They're down by 15. They can they can come back with six, six minutes. 15 is not a lot. Dre's keep, yeah, I know. Dre's keeping the goblins alive here though. He is. Oh, oh when Nick, makes well, Nick, yeah, yeah. Nick finish layers like that, then there's no coming back. Reaper's <laughs> trying to take the life out of this. Here comes Dre. Pass it to Tyreek. Back. Oh, good block from Phil. And here he goes all the way. Dude, Phil, man. He plays good on both sides of the ball, man. The Reaper, that was a big, big win for the Reapers. Oh, good step back by Dre. Juan makes another three. If they keep this up, they can make it a close game. They can. They just gotta be aggressive. There's no defense. Look who's the defense. Oh, even with the tip pass, that's a sweet finish of the day. Brought to you by Ashes Bake Shop. There's just no defense. Absolutely zero defense. And it's not like they're not trying. It's just I just feel like the passing is really just throwing them off. Yeah, it's just dry. You can you can tell from uh, Chief's demeanor. He's just yeah. out of the game. They keep their feet planted because they don't know where the ball's going. So it kind of keeps them on their toes. But sorry, this is the first one. You got to make these free throws too. They're big. They are. Eighty to sixty-two. Last week, La Familia scored 90. Can the Reapers score 90? Or do you think they'll they? score more than 90? I think they can score 90. We'll see. I want to say 90, 92 or 94. I'm going to say I'm gonna say 92. I think I agree with that. Oh, here comes Sway, especially if he's going to keep doing what he does, man. Dude, he is just, wow. He might be 100% from the... <laughs> yeah. He only missed one today. I'm about to make a, a Sway build on 2K. Oh, there goes Dre. Hits Dre another, three. another three. Oh, my goodness. They probably should have gone to him in the beginning they, of the yeah, game. Yeah, they should have. <laughs> We're saying Juan needs to get hot. We need Dre to get hot in the beginning. Nick, the ball, scanning the court. Fonzo dancing his way around Dre and picks up the foul. Nah, Phil said he don't want that foul. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, good, good. Oh, that was such a good drive by Mo. Oh, good pass to Juan. That's the assist of the day. Brought to you by We Buy Houses. And honestly, I think we could probably name Sway the Platinum Player. Brought to you by Chris Galco. And probably, you know, uh, Campus Legends. 
Right, because he's been in the league for three more years. Yeah, he's a vet. three years on yeah. Uh-oh. And by the way, uh, Campus Legends is brought to you by Campus Custom. Campus Custom. Mm -hmm. Oh, they might not make 90 because they're holding the ball. Yeah, they are holding the ball. You're right. We might both be wrong. Phil takes a three-point shot and well, hits. It's not over yet. <laughs> wow. They're down by five. Look, they're down by five to win the game and make 90. <laughs> yeah, this the, the Reapers are a different team. It's night and day. Yeah. It really is. They are. Juan takes a three. Oh, and you could say the same thing for the Goblins, except it's reverse. Yeah. It's night and day from how they started the first half of the season. Gray with a good defense. I would have kept Brandon C. Uh, me too. Oh, another three. Dre oh, my goodness. Hot. They're only down by 14. Dangerous Dre. 14. They're only down by 14. But they, they got to stop. They got to stop. Oh, oh my, my goodness. <laughs> wow. Yeah, no. Uh, Sway Planet Player brought to you by Chris Galco and Campus Legend brought to you by Cantor's Customs. He has to be. And he just hit a sweet finish of the day brought to you by Ash Bishop. <laughs> <laughs> Three in a row. I want to see it all in one short. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> All right, Sway. Doesn't hit that one. Phil does. Oh, my God. I think the Goblins are just, they're just done. Yeah. They checked out mentally. They definitely did. They're looking up at the scoreboard too much. I feel like when it's down to these kind of games, you can't really look at the scoreboard. You got to play like a 0-0. Zero, zero. Mm -hmm. yeah. Shit, that, that's it. That, that is what it is. And with that, we're going to go to the sideline report with Parker. Thank you. Thank you, Josh. All right, look at this team right here, okay? Look at everybody's kind of happy. And then look at that team. All right, now look at this team. All right, and look at that team. Okay, what team do you think is losing by 18? That's very right. Good job, Axel. You pass. You pass. Hey, what? It's okay. Let's look into the Reaper's huddle right now. One, two, three. Finish. finish. They want to finish. Don't we all? All right, we're back. All right, thank you, Parker, for that sideline report. We're going to get back here into the game. Score is 71 so far, 89. The two Reapers, minutes left. The, the guys who stand out really fill and sway. And sway. Those two, as a duo, it's insane. And then you have the, the key players to, yeah, the key hold, player, you know, exactly. to hold them together, like Nick and Fonzo, Fonzo doing a great job on defense. On defense. Um, Being a pesty player. Yeah, Mo. A five, a five game losing streak from the Goblins. Oh, it is a five game losing streak, you're right. If, if, if it was, oh, Batman fights for it, but you can't do it. <laughs> I love the tenacity. Oh, good pass to Fonzo. Fonzo trying to. Ooh. That's a long pass. Yep, Reapers are trying to look to hold on to the ball here and just true clog. Phil with another three. Can't hit. Oh, with the, uh, the Reapers with another rebound. That's another thing that killed the Goblins. The rebounding game. Exactly. They couldn't get it. They couldn't. They just couldn't get it moving today. Oh man, another right three off. for the Reapers. It's 92. Fonzo with a three. Dre for another three. Can't hit. But Juan's there for the putback. Man, honestly, it's it's only been Dre and Juan after that yeah. whole game. I mean, Tyreek was getting going in the beginning, but then just got stale towards the end of the game. And, and then on top of that, you just got Phil doing his thing, yeah. man. That is yeah, going to be a hard thing to think about. 94. 94. 94, so they did score. They did score three. more. Yeah, I mean, Tyreek makes that three, but makes little to no difference here. Sway! Oh, my, I mean, that's Nick. Oh, my goodness. Takes a shot to the ribs and still makes it. He's improved his inside game as well this season. Wow. <laughs> what I tell you? Dean's hand in the air. If you're looking for Dean, just look for a hand in the air. You're up by 20. You're up by 20. You're up by 20. The clock. Is that like a mercy? Is that like a mercy rule? So that they're in the mercy rule, so what's gonna happen is the clock is gonna keep winding down just so we can keep the flow in the game. I don't want to say you're winning the game. Oh, here comes Dre! And he makes it. 
And that's going to be the end of the game. 97 to 78. The Reapers put the Goblins to rest. And now the Goblins go 4 and 5, while the Reapers improve to 4 and 5. That's crazy. That is crazy. Five game win I mean, losing streak. It is. That's the rule. All right, guys. Thank you for joining us here. Another exciting day of Selling Nation basketball. Can't wait for game two. Ziggy, thank you for joining me here today. Anytime. Nice. It was a pleasure. <laughs> First time.